offices. Since this world was the offseason right for you, what was the decision to join the Bengals? I'm not gonna lie, it was a tough off season for me. Uh, I'd say the last two years have been really hard, but uh, you know, since coming here, I had a good conversation with uh, Andy, the goalie coach, and uh, I've never been in a in a better headspace since uh, since then. I've worked, improved some things in my game right away that really made sense to me, and uh, and it kind of changed my whole mindset, the way I was seeing things and. Uh, you know, I, 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 I'm in a good headspace right now. I truly believe that I could be back uh, be even better than I was before. So, uh, very motivated. Very motivated. Can you explain that there are any certain things that are improved or you feel have to improve in just a short time with the Bengals so far? It, it, it's technical stuff. The way I, I, uh, I stand over the puck. Uh, you know, we watch video of my last couple games and video of my previous games and it kind of click right away. And uh, I was able to apply it to my uh, my practices here right away. Made a huge difference, and um, and the rest kind of fell behind after. Like you know, we were my, my head, the way I was approaching my games and my daily practices. Um, and it'd be a shame if I uh, if I didn't uh, if I didn't get another chance because I, I I didn't put in the effort like I should. And uh, right now, my, my my only focus is to invest everything into my uh, my game. So whether it's on it or off the ice. Am I to understand that maybe you felt like you didn't put in the right effort before or enough effort before? No. I don't want to twist your words. <laughs> no, no, no. It, like I don't want to hide behind uh, somebody that I'm not. So if I was to tell you that I was putting in the, the full effort the last two years wasn't the case when I look back like I left some on the table left some on the table in Jersey not because I wasn't working hard but uh, it, like to me it's all about my headspace the way I'm approaching my uh, my work and my game and uh, my level of uh, motivation and this summer like you don't have to look further than this summer I wasn't in a good headspace whatsoever I didn't believe in myself I didn't believe that I could be back to where I was and and, and to be honest, my, my game on the ice, even in practices, wasn't showing that either. So how could you believe it? And now I, uh, I really, really made a switch. And, and um, I came here uh, thinking I was motivated, but I really w wasn't. And now uh, it, it really, really switched for me like instantly. And, uh, and I feel it. And that's something that's hard to, to get. And right now I feel it. I feel motivated. I feel uh, like I'm going somewhere, and and um, I really made the decision to invest everything into myself and into hockey. Like it, it, leave nothing behind. Was it COVID that, that maybe detracted from your motivation? Well, I, I bounced around that that year when I went from uh, you know Tampa to Syracuse to Binghamton to Jersey to Vancouver, and then in the bubble, and then I went to Calgary where I I played. I didn't play really. I practiced with three, three person on the ice uh, every morning before the team practiced, and um, that whole really since COVID hit, it, it, it's been really hard. Not only uh, on me and on my game, but on my my mental approach to the game and my uh, my mental health. It was really hard and uh, and tough to uh, to balance family and and hockey and staying motivated on top of things and it's hard when you you don't you're not involved in team activities so last year was really hard and this long summer where i i didn't really have any bites whether it was in europe or uh here and i don't blame him my game wasn't showing anything and um, i'm glad that i got an opportunity here and uh, i feel i feel really solid right now how do you see yourself fitting into the organizational hierarchy? You have two established guys here, Tristan Casey, a couple of young guys who are being the minor assistant. Where do you see yourself fitting into all this? I'm, I'm going day to day. I'm going day to day and, and trying to improve my game. You know, I know I, I can tell you that I'm here or there. I, it doesn't matter I, as long as I, uh, I go about my business every day and I, I just solely focus on stopping pucks. And when I'm off the ice, I. I focus on putting good things in my body and, and uh, getting some rest to be ready for the next day. You know, if it's not, uh, if, if nothing happens this year and I play in Willsbury all year, then this is what's going to happen. But uh, I'm, I'm okay with it because I'm working on my game and I know I'll be back. So I can't really tell you where I, 
where I'm gonna film the organization. I'm, I'm here today and I'm happy to be here. Thanks, Thank you. Thank you.